Hello dear viewers and welcome to my channel, here we give you the latest news direct from America. I don't want to be who I used to be. Selena Gomez exudes charm, poses for Hollywood's Vanity Fair, and admits to being triggered by Disney's past. She spent her past as a Disney star and finally felt liberated. Before we continue please if you are new to this channel, take a minute of your treasured time to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. The 30-year-old actress first appeared on screen as a child of Barney and Friends, but gained wider fame when she starred in the Disney Channel series The Wizard of Waverly Place from 2007 to 2012. Selena, who appeared at the annual Hollywood edition of Vanity She Fair, said she's working hard to get away from family time with her brand. She said, Sometimes I turn on I am not ashamed of my past, just that I have worked hard to find my way. I don't want to be myself. I want to be myself Selena has also appeared in Wizards of Waverly Place and has released her music through Hollywood her records signed with other Disney her stars, including Hilary Duff, Milly Cyrus and the Jonas Brothers. The star also said that early in her career, she was sometimes told she couldn't say or do certain things. She said, I was never a wild kid, but I was at Disney and had to be careful not to say, what's this? But. It also set me up to be the best role model I could be. I think the best role model right now is to be honest, even if there are some ugly and difficult parts of yourself. Selena previously told People that she felt a lot of pressure during the show to be perfect, because she was seen as a role model for young people. She said. In a way it was my job to be perfect. You are seen as a character that children look up to, and they take it seriously. Elsewhere, during an interview with Vanity Fair, Selena was asked what advice she would give to young people starting their careers in Hollywood. She spoke without hesitation. But this industry is a beast. It's really scary to see what would happen if you were given so much power and money at such a young age. Selena added that young people need to be careful who they trust and expressed her relief that her nine-year-old sister Gracie has shown no interest in working in the industry. The singer also opened up about her bipolar diagnosis in the documentary Selena Gomez. Thoughts and Me. The star says she's not ashamed of her diagnosis and her film allowed her to be honest about everything. Selena Gomez hopes to make people smile with her new album Berry Pop. Selena Gomez wants to release her music that makes people happy. In a new cover for Vanity Fair magazine, the My Mind and Me singer shared new details about the sound of her upcoming album, saying she's opted for a very pop sound. Given the choice, she could have written ballads all her life, but I want to make music that makes people smile, she said. The music I'm making now is about the reality I'm experiencing. It's really powerful, it's loud, it's very pop. The whole theme is freedom. Freedom from relationships, freedom from darkness, she added. It's as if she was sharing with Rolling Stone for the history of the press at the end of last year, and she had already written 24 songs for projects and wanted to increase the letter session. Told. My heart and I are a little sad, she told Rolling Stone. And the date when I talk to myself. She added as follows. I think it's an album that looks like the following. She is just living in life. In an interview with Vanity Fairs, the only killing of the building actress explained how she completely removed the social network, but rather decided that her assistant had launched a digital account. The world was my high school for so long that I started getting information I didn't need. I went through a tough breakup and didn't want to see reviews not necessarily about relationships, opinions about me and me. Anyone else, she told the magazine. There would be thousands of really good comments, but I immediately think of the bad. She added. People can call me ugly or stupid. But I was like, it doesn't matter but these people are fine. They write such specific and awkward paragraphs. I cried all the time. I had constant anxiety I couldn't take it anymore. It was a waste of time. Alongside his collaboration with Nigerian star Rima on Take It Easy and her collaboration with Coldplay on Let Somebody Go. Gomez is out. Thanks.